Mamma Mia! Hey everyone, it's Darby from Blue Television Games. Today we're going to be looking at five different really amazing Super Mario Maker 2 levels that you guys should check out. And we're going to start off with one of my favorites I've played so far in Super Mario Maker 2 by a guy named Mr. Sparky. It's called Gotta Claw Fast. Let's start it up. This level's pretty difficult uh, until you get down everything. It's a little bit of memorization. Let's see how I do it. I haven't played it since the stream, but let's turn off those comments and start over because we don't want to be blocked by the comments. Here we go. So it's a lot of back and forth in. And by that, I mean you go back and forth quite a bit. Once you have everything memorized, it's not so bad. I already feel like I'm doing a lot better than I did during the stream. I kind of screwed that up. I don't know if it matters. I spun once when I wasn't supposed to spin. Off Bowser Jr. Off Bowser Jr. again. Here we're just kind of auto bouncing for a second. And here we need to spin again. We're actually off to a good start. We might get it on our very first try. That felt pretty dang good. There we go. Awesome. Very awesome level. It probably looked a little easier than it actually is. It takes a few tries to get it down, but it's really intense, really fun, and really well put together. Sadly, we didn't get that world record. All right, let's move on to the next. All right, this next level is Sonic 3 Ice Cap Zone from Kaich Jam. Let's do it. I always say Kaich Jam. Maybe it's just Catch Jam, but that Y, it really makes me want to say Kaich Jam. Kaich Jam. All right, we're going to blue toad it for one more level, and then maybe we'll switch it up. So to start off, we just do a little buzzy beetle riding. Easy peasy, Lemon Luigi. That's a really cool way to start the level. And really well thought out. I think we have our first checkpoint already. And what's nice about that is we don't have to watch that intro over and over again, although we really might want to. I screwed that up. A lot of these contraptions I'll probably screw up. You know what you're doing, a lot of this level will just flow really nice. We'll grab the 30 coin while we're waiting for that bomb to blow that up. Okay, now I believe there's something tricky about this. Oh yeah, one thing I learned is you can slide through icicles. I didn't know that, but now I do. And then, what do we want to do here? I forget. Okay, hold on. <laughs> I can remember this. Get the 30 coin and bounce off of that. Oh yeah, we need to set this off because that... We'll uh, ignite the bob bomb. If we stand right here, we won't get blown up. And we can go through once that goes by. <laughs> no, why did I do that? Oh, well, we get another mushroom. I panicked. I panicked. All right. Bounce up here. I'm definitely doing this a little sloppy, but you get the idea. I love these little springy platforms. Lots of sliding. I'd love to see this compared to the original level that it's remaking. All right. Slide through some icicles. Jump up here. We can go in the pipe. And we get another checkpoint. Beautiful. Ooh, that could have bounced us up to the high area, but we screwed it up. So we'll take the low route. That's kind of making a Sonic-like loop there. It's pretty cool. Some loop de loos the best way we can in Mario Maker. I'm pretty curious about that top route now. Missed a coin, but at least we can get hit by that giant... Uh, uh, skewer. Skewer, that's what that's called. <laughs> I couldn't think of what it was called. There we go. Bust the end. There's some pigs there. We'll let the animals out and finish the level. Definitely a cool one. I didn't do the level much justice as I didn't do a lot of the bouncing around perfectly, but well designed, very fun, and I got the world record. What do you know? All right, let's move on to the next. All right, this one's called Sheer Heart Attack. This one is also really, really fun and pretty intense. I remember the ending especially being very scary. And if you're wondering, I played all these levels in a race stream I did with Lair where we were racing each other, trying to beat levels as fast as possible. And I just tagged some of my favorite levels. I thought it'd be fun to showcase them for you guys. Give you guys some cool levels to play. Uh, here we gotta do some wall jumping. Off screen, bounce off the bonds I built. Don't go too far, get in the red pipe. All right, now this is probably where I'm going to screw up. Drop down here. Actually doing pretty good. I remember this being a lot more difficult during the stream, but maybe now that I've gotten some practice, it feels pretty easy. If you like some 
crazy fast dashing type of levels. You'll definitely enjoy this one. Okay, here's where things got tricky. Oh no, we got smashed! That is the tricky part. <laughs> I think we need to jump, get above that thwomp, and then, uh, yeah, then we can get the flagpole. Now, during the stream, somehow I grabbed that flagpole there, and I have no idea how. But, uh, maybe this time we'll get it. That definitely felt a little better. Bounce off you. Into the red pipe. This game is so fun. How many of you guys are just loving Mario Maker 2? I just think it's just amazing. It's even better than I expected. I just love this game. We're actually a little behind there, but that's okay. Very intense. I love levels like that. this that just use very little elements, but still manage to make something really creative and really fun. Ooh, the top... The top thwomp didn't come by that time or something happened there? I don't know. It was definitely easier that time. Good job, Luigi. We did it. I got two more sweet levels for you guys coming right up. All right, this one's called Pyramid Trials. And this one's a story level. And I didn't really get to enjoy the story much because me and Lair were racing during the live stream. So let's go ahead and turn the comments on. This machine checks for multiplayer. The level starts after the pipe. That's pretty cool. A multiplayer checker machine. I did not know that existed. I like it. Okay. So that is really, really awesome. All right. So anyways, uh, we don't really have any choice but to go in this door first. Please don't comment near walls as it will be visible from the other side. Okay. That's fine. Okay. Now we can go up here. A hidden room? Nice. <laughs> As there's some things about this level that just get really, really cool. We find a key in there. We also hit the switch, which should change something up here. I believe we just want to go through the locked door. A lot of these areas look kind of similar, so it gets a little confusing. And we got a fire flower, fire toadette. Always awesome. All right, now we can go up this way. Okay, what's in here? Just a coin, some more coins. There's a part coming up that I just thought was great, and it's an awesome idea that I think a lot of people are going to eventually be using in their levels. Here we can grab that sweet, sweet checkpoint. I love the checkpoints with Toadette. A little pink mushroom, it's very cool. Alright, into the door. Okay. Time your jump carefully if you want the 30 coin, or go back through the door for no apparent reason, because I actually hit up a lot. We got the 30 coin! Woohoo! So I guess... There isn't much of a story here as I thought there was. Woo, that was close. The middle of the bridge might not be safe. Oh, we're okay. Oh, nope, nope. Please don't take away my fire flower and I won't kill you, piranha plants. I love you can put piranha plants on walls now, by the way. Okay, this switch we do not want on. This seems very suspicious. I wouldn't stand near this wall. It'll probably explode. This is the part that I thought was really cool. So these on-off switches start busting through the walls and you end up getting these little on-off switch puzzles. Oops. That I am very, very good at, obviously. There we go. And then that ice block blows up the wall. Very, very cool. There's probably a reward for going this way. Be careful, one of Bowser's strongest minions is in the next room. But we want the reward. So let's see if we can get this little on-off switch puzzle here. As long as we pay attention here, it looks like everything's good. Bust through the wall again. 10 coin, we have one last puzzle. I just thought this was a really cool section. Hadn't really seen anyone use on-off blocks quite like this. It's definitely really cool. There we go, through the last wall. I love scroll locking, opening up stuff like that. We already had a fire flower, so not that much of a reward for us, but that's okay. Into the pipe. And Boom Boom Fight. Flying Boom Boom Fight. Flying Boom Boom is quite crazy. But if we're careful, we should be okay. Oh, settle down, Flying Boom Boom. I like that's got a little song here, too. Custom song. Very cool. There we go. We got the key. I guess we'll go through the left door. I don't know if it matters, really. It's probably just for symmetry. Yep. Thanks for playing my level. I hope you enjoyed it. I loved it enough to showcase it in a video. Hopefully lots of people will watch it. 
Get that sweet, sweet, sweet Toadette 100. That looks like she went into a door there. That was a really cool ending. Definitely an awesome level. All right, for the last level we're going to play today is actually one that I got a false code for during the stream. So I actually don't even know if this is a good level or not. I guess we'll find out together. It's from Efox. It's called Super Mario Bros. 3 Speed... <laughs> Super Mario Bros. 3 Speed Run. If I could talk, let's do it. And here we go. Jump up. And we die. <laughs> this actually looks like it's going to be pretty fun. So this might be a cool one to end the video on. Let me know if you guys want to see more videos like this where I showcase some really cool levels. Okay, okay, I see what's going on here. Because uh, I think this is a lot of fun. It's a cool way to showcase. I'll still be doing uh, stream highlight videos as well. A lot of people seem to like those. Okay, well, that was not correct. Whoa, this is a really short level. So I think everything just has to line up perfectly. So we go like it. That definitely wasn't any good. There we go. No! Oh, we had it! Dang it! No! We had it! Dang it! Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go! Yes! There we go, we did it! That was actually a pretty fun little quick challenging level. Definitely a cool way to end this video with something that I hadn't played yet. So I like that. Once again, guys, let me know if you want to see some more videos like this where I showcase a bunch of cool levels that you guys should check out. All right, guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the thumbs up button. Also be sure to hit that notification bell if you want updates whenever I release a new video. I do lots of Super Mario Maker 2 content. If you're new to the channel and you like what you see, be sure to hit the subscribe button. Thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, I'll see you around. Thank you.